All right, we're going to actually go over our chapter summary that's found on page 33. So, um, a rapidly increasing rate of EHR adoption combined with up-to-date curriculum for medical assistance has made medical assisting one of the fastest growing professions in the United States. Not just medical assistance, but actually administrative medical assistance, what we're going into. There are a number of resources available for students to help with navigating the SCMO, which is the SIM charts for the medical office. Um, now that you guys can get in, then you can get on and play and see what you can do. You can get into the simulation playground and play anytime. It is your playground to play in. Yes, ma'am. With the simulation playground, I went and did those, um, the page 35, 36, and 37. Uh-huh. And then went to go back to it, and it had swiped, like, deleted the three that I already put in. Um, you, there's a save feature somewhere. You have to find it. Let, let me see if I can share my screen. Let me see if we can go to it. Because um, yeah, I don't know about that either. Can y'all see this? Yes. Okay. Okay, remember that you guys are gonna go to canvas.com because I'm on instructor site, it looks different for me. So just bear with me. Okay, canvas by Elsevier. Okay, and then you get into your EBC day SIM charting. SIM charts for the medical office. Hmm. So you click that. Does it look the same on y'all's? No okay. okay, this is all assignments that I have not assigned. I've only done the first one so you could actually see it. But your orange button, your simulation playground, you click it. I'm going to start a new simulation. So start. Oh, I've got to turn off my pop up blocker. Hang on. Oh, no, wait, hold on. What you got, Miss Sue? So when you start a new one like that, is that the one that says start and save the previous? Because they give you two options. Start brand new without saving and start with saving the previous. Let's see. It says return to previous session with saved patient information. Start yeah. with new simulation session and clear all previously saved patient information. So you see, that's what's happening. You got to hit that top one. Alexis, you see that? Did you click that? No, I hit start new. Okay, Whatever. all right. All right. So um, that's what's happening right there because I did that mistake the first day and it was like, oh, no, you don't. <laughs> well, um, yeah. but you guys, all have you all been able to see any of this stuff? You recognize yeah. this, your ad appointment, then you have your clinical care, and it moves over to there. And these are all the patients you'll be putting in, and then your billing and coding portion. It's actually really, really a cool thing. All right, so just continue to play in that. Just a second, I'm getting out of all of this stuff. Do, 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 do. Oh, stop share. There we go. Hi, Joe. Hi, Joe. Um, yeah, I I'm going to run out of time. Um, so um, let's go ahead and do the um, the answers for the review activities, and then we'll go back to chapter summary. You all have read that, and uh, um, so it's not as a big of a issue with that, but I want to make sure you get your answers on the, your review activities so you can study them. Okay, so we're going to do key terms review. Number one is C. D, B, A, E, F. 
okay for this uh, i don't know did you guys do the scavenger hunt Ooh, you're frozen Ooh. There we go. We're I shouldn't be frozen. Well, you're not now, but you know, my internet connection is unstable. So, um, did you guys do the scavenger? Hunt? <laughs> Who did the scavenger hunt? I said it all to you. Okay, that's just something fun. You're welcome to go do it. I just think it's a good way for you get to to get to know the um, the uh, sim chart for the medical office. Okay, and now we're going to move to true false. Number one is false. Two is false. Three is false. Four is false. Five is true. Six is false. Seven is false. Eight is false. Nine is true. 10 is false. 11 is true. 12 is false. A great way to study, guys, is to look at these false questions and make them true. Does anybody do that to study? It's just a neat what? little thing that you can do. So, in workplace place applications, I know that some of you turned that in previously and then I put it on today's. If you've turned it in previously, don't worry. I already have it, okay? No, I already did another one. <laughs> uh, well, Miss Lisa, if I've asked for, like before when I said review activities, inadvertently I didn't put don't do workplace applications and you guys being awesome the way you are, you just did it all. So if I have some gaps like that, just please forgive me. It's a lot to keep up with, and I'm completely out of my element with writing it down and, and doing it that way. But you don't have to rework. Okay. Just shoot me a text or, or give me a quick uh, email or phone call and say, hey, I put that on blah, blah, blah. But usually I remember. Um, so, but you don't have to, you know, redo work and redo work and redo work unless you want to. I mean, you're more than welcome uh, to do whatever I'm, I'm you okay like. I'm with it. But <laughs> I, 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 I resented it mine, but. It's because I had mine saved and I just shot it to you again. Yeah. Thank you, Miss Lou. I saved I appreciate everything. That. Um, so that is really pretty much it. Just go back over your chapter again. Um, I read a little bit of the chapter summary, but just read through that. Make sure you know your key terms. I've done a couple of quizlets. One of them's a little more intensive than the, or a little bit more information than the other one. I'm not crazy. I do know that I gave you two quizlets. Like I said, one's easy, one's a little bit more difficult with more information. So that's just an easy way to study. Does anybody have anything for me? No, just that I sucked on that Quizlet. <laughs> well, you can take it as many times as you want. I'm unmute. Uh, I'm unmuting you, Miss Rebecca. Hang on. There you go. What you got, Miss Rebecca? Hang on. It's still on you. Oh, there are we, we go. Doing, what you got? Are we, having, are we having Edmodo today? Um, yeah, there are lessons on Edmodo today. Because I looked and there weren't. It says Free April fresh. 2nd on there. Refresh it. Log out and log back in. Yeah, our, when you get onto your computer, just refresh it. Refresh it. Edmodo does not refresh well. So I constantly have to refresh mine, but they're there. I already have some submissions this morning. So um, if you're having trouble, just let me know and we'll figure it out from there. Okay, Don't anybody? Call me. I was taking a quiz at six o'clock this morning. <laughs> um, any questions? Anybody having any trouble? Everybody, are you okay? We're working, you're okay? I know this is so different. I'm so proud of y'all for hanging in with me and staying positive. I can always count on you guys for my positivity. I need that. Um, especially since we've got the extension and I keep going. I have a calendar right here and I keep counting the days. <laughs> I'm ready to get back in the class and be with you guys. How much longer? 
how much longer do some of them have? I mean, are we like Kelly and Kelly? Or will they be out by the time Jordan. we go back? Um, what's y'all's finish date, Kelly? My last day, me and Kelly's last day is May twenty first. Yeah, so they'll. What about, they'll okay. And to me and Jordan's right before that, I think. Yeah, a week right? before. Yeah, a week before. Okay, hang hang on. I can't hear you, Tamia. What'd you say, Mia? Unmute her. Okay, there you go, Mia. What'd you say? <laughs> me and Jordan either May 14th or May 15th. So um, hopefully we'll be back to school for that for like a hot minute, right? But still, um, those of you who are getting ready to uh, to transition out, you know the login for the NCCT prep. It's all there. I was gonna. I mean, I will send it to you, girl. It's been on that whiteboard forever, but I will send it to you as soon as we hang up. I'll shoot you a text, okay, Mia? Um, but I was gonna do a whole lot of different things. I just don't have time. You guys have that resource. Please use it. If you don't use it, that's you, not me. <laughs> use that resource. So anything else before we get off? Days. Huh? I only got 19 days left. But you'll be back. I know. And right. uh, I texted Lauren the other day and she said oh, she's I gotta doing tell good. Go ahead. She's doing good, and, but she is scared, she said. Give me just a second. I'm going to get everybody muted. Okay, so I talked to Lauren this morning, and uh, she thought she was going to go in and have the baby today, but what they're going to do is she's going in, and they're going to insert, I can't, she told me I didn't write it down, this, insert this thing that actually softens the cervix. So she'll go get have that done at 11 o'clock and she'll go back tomorrow and get put on the drip and she will probably have baby Liam either tomorrow or Saturday morning. So she is scared but I told her that we were sending her hugs and loves and that it was okay to be scared but she's brave and she can do this. So I think she felt better. So if y'all want to text her today or call her today then uh, you're more than welcome to do that. I'm sure she would um, love to hear from you guys. I'm trying to. Yeah, she. Like yeah, she she's very, feeling very scared, and I told her it's normal. Every, especially those of us who oh. have kids, we all feel scared and unsure. Of, yeah. Especially with our first one. Yeah. All right, if there's nothing else, I'm going to let you ladies get on with your day. Thank you, thank you so much for your positivity and your help and everything that you're doing every day. Your work is great. Some of you are still my extra crew, which I love that. <laughs> you know who you are. <laughs> but um, I will, tomorrow is exam day. There is no reason to do Zoom class tomorrow. Okay, what's on the exam? Just what we've been looking at? Anything else? No, it's easy. And Miss Sue, you have your book. So yeah, there's something I do. That you don't quite know. But um, these little quizzes, there's not much to them. So um, anyway, all right. Have a great day. And I will be talking to you guys on Monday. No Zoom class. If you need me, try to get to me before 2 o'clock, please. If not, I don't know what I'm saying. Text me, call me anyway, I don't know. <laughs> I'm a little bit so, of a control lady. <laughs> anyway, love you guys. Bye. Bye.